In this lesson, we're going to learn how to use some of the basic features of Google Docs. I've gone to drive.google.com and I've signed in using my full email address. On the Google Drive screen, I'm going to left click on the new button and from the menu, I'm going to choose Google Docs. Now Google Docs will now load. This will look similar to other word processing programs you may have used. In the top left hand corner it currently says untitled document. This is our file name of our new document so I'm going to call this my first doc and I'm going to click on my page. I'm now going to type in the title of my work and I'm going to write in my first sentence. Now I'm going to customize my work, so I'm going to left click and highlight my title. And across the top on the menu screen, we have the styles drop down. These are pre made styles that we can use, so I'm just going to click on title, and this will automatically change my title to that style. Further across, we have our font, so I can pick different styles of writing. Let's have impact. And over to the right, we also have our font size. We can make our writing smaller, or we can make our writing larger. We can also type a number into our font size box and just press enter to choose a font number that isn't there. I can also move my title into the center of the page. Over here, we're on left aligned at the moment. I have the option to move it into the center of the page or to right justify it. So there's center and the right hand justify. So I'm gonna put this back to the center. I can also underline my title using the little letter U up here. I'm gonna come back down to my first sentence down here because we have some other options. I can make my font bold and I can also have it in italics. We have also the text color so I can go in and I can highlight the piece of writing and change it to another color. I can also decide that I would like to change this font so I'm going to highlight my writing and up the top under the font drop down I can click on here. We have a small list of fonts that are available however by clicking on the more fonts option this will load up lots of other fonts that we can also install. We can use a search function or really useful is we can pick the style of font that we would like from here. So we can pick say display and these are nice clear bold fonts. There we go, let's have this one. And I'm just going to click on OK and that will now add that font into my list for future use. Another useful feature at the top is the bullet points. I can just click on the bullet point and it will add in a little bullet point. We can click on the little arrow next to the bullet point and we can customize it to a different style of bullet points. When you've finished writing your document don't forget you don't need to save just make sure that all changes saved in Drive are showing up the top. 